In this video, I'm going to share with you some ideas of how you can help your child learn to write numbers. The best learning is always done through incidental and while you're out and about, so down at the beach when you've been collecting some shells and if you have four, showing your child how you would write that in the sand or if you're outside and a stick and in the dirt, um, also doing it that way. But if the child, your child is wanting to do more formal work and they're requesting, how do I write that number five or how do I do this? Great, they're ready for learning that. If they're not wanting, that's fine. When they come to school, they'll learn that there as well. With teaching numbers, it can become quite tricky for children. It's like us learning a new alphabet. So there's certain rhymes that we can use that can help them remember which way things go, especially when you come to the twos and threes, which are trickier. So I have certain rhymes and I'll share them with you. Number one is like a stick, a straight line that is really quick. Number two goes around and back and then along the railway track. Number three goes around a tree, around a tree, that's the way to make a three. With number four, it's down and across and down once more, that's the way to make a four. Number five is down and around and a hat on top to make your five. Number five is a great place to start, up to five with your children, especially in kinder um, with turning four and then turning five. That's a very good time to start in. Let's write the number. You've got four candles on your cake. This is how we write the number four and so on. And making up your own rhymes that go um, with the letters. Have your children make up a rhyme or a sentence or a way that they can remember. The greatest learning is done together, where parents work together with their children and make every opportunity a learning experience. It doesn't definitely need to be a sit down. We are going to be learning about when you're out and about counting objects, when you're down at the beach counting different objects, looking at signs, looking at letters. Um, there's learning all around us and the greatest teacher there ever is is a parent that's you and we just help so good luck working with your wonderful children